Hello everybody, it's Sherry here with Lamore Pores, and as promised, I'm gonna show a video of my two grandchildren doing my new technique, a pearl pour, and they just turned out beautiful. So here my girls are again. This is Farron and Adeline. They are cousins, my son and daughter's daughters. And here we are, they grew up together, and uh, here we are on Easter Sunday. So the thing about a pearl pour is no gloves, lots of paint on your hands. And we're back. And we're back. <laughs> All right. And they are uh. back. So I really wanted them to feel the paint on their hands and also this technique just by chance. It's good to have gloves off so that you can feel the paint because you try to keep the paint on the board with your hands. And I was teaching them that today. So for the rest of the video, um, I'm going to just play the music and let you watch. I did cut this video down quite a bit um, because of YouTube and Facebook, but um, I wanted you to hear how they have fun and play and all of us having fun in the studio when we do art. So, enjoy. So remember, we're gonna hold the sides with our hands. You can hold it with your hands with your thumbs, this one. Just bring it up and start moving that color around. Yeah, just keep moving it. Hold it with your hand, good, bring it back. Come on, you gotta cover that whole board. You gotta cover the whole board with your color. We want that color to come off. Yes, keep going, yes, beautiful. Keep going, oh good, 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 fairy. Go on, get it off the edge. All the way off the edge, Farron. On the top here, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, Farron, all the way, tilt, 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 tilt. Good, good, good. Bring it back. Oh, you're starting to get, you're starting to get some cells. Let me see if you can do. Oh, so are you, Farron? Oh my God. Oh, I'm loving this. I'm loving it. Okay. It's making a big mess. Oh, it is not. That sometimes we just need to not use gloves. Okay, let's put them down. So here I want them to feel that paint in their hands and I'm telling them to rub it around, feel it and love it. Love it like their grandmother does. Oh, these are beautiful. I'm holding this. I'm holding No, I called the in it first. Done. And this is about an hour after the paintings were done. And all of these pearl cells came up in that time. And their paintings turned out so beautiful. Um, really, uh, two of my favorites from my girls. Look how pretty that is. You know, it just, I love the technique. I'm gonna go ahead and resin them. I think this technique looks beautiful when it is resined, and uh, the girls will have these for a lifetime. So, um, these are close-ups, obviously, and a little video I did of them, and here they are now, dry today. Put them up on the wall. This is Adeline's, love it. And this one here, of course, is Farron's, and love this one, too. So I hope to see you at the next video and I assure you my grandchildren will be back.